god. Hmm. What? You did wonders here. This is good. Thanks, babe. Take five. <laughs> Give me five. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, sir. Tomorrow. Um, yes, sir. Okay. Yes, I will handle it. Yeah, bye. <sighs> What's that? My boss. Any problem? Ah, uh, there's no problem. Okay. He wants me to head the team that will be visiting the less privileged. At the orphanages and hospitals. Honey, such type of job is really taxing and stressful. I know. I don't even know how I'm going to handle all this tomorrow. Just take it easy, okay? The Lord is your strength. Just believe you can do it. Mm. Hmm? Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. That's the information we gathered from the school the teachers. I think your brother is in some kind of danger. Mm. Eh? What did you just say? No, Dima, my brother in danger. Are you are you okay? No, did you did you did you hear her? God forbid. What are you saying? Please, I I don't like that energy. I like Romia. Ah. It's high time you and your family started looking for solution. Yes. Thank you. God bless you. And I am done with this discussion. Brother, can I know he's not in danger? He will definitely come back. Thank you. Ah, which is okay now. We are not quarreling. We're just sure trying you to shoot talk so much. Thank you for saving my life. It's okay. Good. I appreciate it. Thank you. God bless. <coughs> oh, sorry, sorry. Take it easy. Uh, sorry. God bless you. It's okay. Just, just calm down. <coughs> Can I? We need anything. Can I get water, please? Just hold that here. It's okay. Um, you will go well, eh? Mm. Of course, you know what I've told you already. Be mindful of your environment, that's all. I will, Papa. Mm? I hey, will. And let me add my own. Mm? Mm. When you get there, call us. Okay, Nania. Remember me. Remember your father. I remember where you're coming from. Don't go there and disgrace me. I will. She's an adult. The word is enough for a wise person. She's wise. Mama, I'll miss you. Come on, come on. Oh, Tatam. Tatam.
How about you? Let's dip in your... Uh, Not just a... Uh, was totally healed. Wow. Mr. Ikena. Doctor. This is very impressive. Your recovery rate is very, very encouraging. And in no distant time, you'll be out of here. Okay? Thank you, Doctor. Yeah. Nurse, let me have this right here. Okay. I'm happy for you. Thanks, bro. I appreciate it. Thank you. You're welcome. So, Nurse, you take this to the pharmacy, okay? Okay, Doctor. And let's get those prescriptions. Okay, Oh, wow, that's very, very impressive. That's very impressive. You know, distance time. I think you be good to go. But in the meantime, can you give us any useful information as to I mean, how we can get to your people? Wow. Was there any phone on me at the accident scene? I don't think I saw any phone. And even who brought you a check, and there was no phone. Wow. I was having this small phone on me that very day. That's okay. I can I can remember my parents' phone numbers. Oh, that's nice. I'm done. I'm done. Fine. So let's have it. That of my father first. Okay. Zero eight one. Okay. Yes. Yes. Hello. Yes. My son. Yes, that, that's my son. I'm, 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 doctor, uh, which hospital is that? Oh, okay, uh, doctor, uh, I, I'll, be, I'll be right there. I, I'll be right there. There you go. There you go. Mommy, Kenna! Mommy, Kenna! Please, I'm going to the hospital. Mwegeji, uh, do you have money? Hey, I don't know. Hey, 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 hey. Off to the hospital to do what? Uh, hey, one doctor called me that the weekend our son is hospitalized. <laughs> Fat life. What? I said, the flavor that called you, that he's a doctor, also called me. Really? Eh, hey, he called me. He came to our son, connived with one of the that calls himself a doctor to get money from us because wherever he is, I know he wants money. Eh? Yeah? Oh, didn't you hear that he uh, 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 absconded with the money that his proprietor gave to him? Eh, Noria? Hey! hey! Put you, put you, put you. Don't need to shout. Hey, well, when did our son he can become a criminal? Okay, you are just realizing it. Kita Kema, Moa, I'm his mother. I know since. And whenever I scold him, you say take it easy. Well, and why you? If you go near, no. you have seen what he has done to. If you go near, put you, what the hell man? You go, nothing is happening. Kita is a thief. What he I wants to come on. That's more change. Cause he and he he wants to take it from us. What a grave, no, who come from more capo. Hi, ha! Hey, you know, my relax, yeah, oh, just relax. He can't. And when I be my kid, don't mind him. By the time he realizes that what we know what he knows, he will come back home. Eh? Oh, he can't. He will come back. Yeah, he will come back. Just don't bother yourself. Come, let's go inside. Good night. Happier. Mm. Happier. Oh, let's go inside. Mm. He will come. Oh, nah. The doctor said you'll be discharged today. Mm. I am much better today. I'm happy too. Tony, thank you for everything you've done for me. I really appreciate that. It's a pleasure. Thank you. You're welcome. But what surprises me most is that none of your parents or relatives have shown up. Even after we called them severally. You said something you're not telling us. Tony, my only crime is that I am poor. 
I am a graduate. And I've been looking for a job for more than five years. My younger brother is a businessman and he's doing so well in business. My parents, my parents, according to the respect, they're supposed to call to me because he's the one shouldering the whole responsibility at home. And I can't even provide anything for them and so. I would say I lost that um, first son's right in my family. Hmm. Anyway, it's all right. What is your discipline? I studied uh, mechanical engineering. As a matter of fact, I graduated with second class upper division. Hmm. And you have been unemployed for the past five years? Oh, yes, five years. <sighs> Mikina, mm -hmm. I think you have a spiritual problem. Or rather, let me say, I think you need a spiritual consultancy. Don't worry, you know what? I have someone I will introduce you to. I'm sure he can help you. Just. I think. Tony. The truth is, I am tired of patronizing these charlatans who call themselves I or the gods or men of gods for solutions. Why did you say so? You see, I've, I've had a bitter encounter in the past. I wasted my time, my energy, my resources without anything meaningful. You see, some of these guys are frosters, masquerading as helpers. And they'll end up not giving you a single help. Well, I understand you very well. But I can tell you for free that Pastor John is different. I have witnessed him lead people to the path of destiny. Oh. All right. If you say so, and I pray, let this be my last bus stop. I hope so too. Can we go now? Sure. Be please talk to us now. The excitement is too much. Uh, uh, you guys should calm down. Take a ship you. Okay, anyway. There is this young man from my maternals that I've been chatting with for a while now. He invited me to come to city. Well, he said he wants to marry ah, me. For marry you. love. Yes. <laughs> wow. Yes, yeah, so he looks so serious. And he has been sending me money, expensive gifts. But I don't want to conclude until I see him. No wonder. So what about Ikena? <clears throat> like I said earlier, Ikena and I, we are just friends. Chokwangozi. I, I want to download this. Are you saying no relationship between you and my elder brother? Oh my god. How do you guys want me to explain this? Me and Ikena, we don't have anything. We are just friends. Wow. My love, I wish you best of luck. Oh, thank you. Congratulations, my dear. Oh, thank you. Mm -mm. No, thank you yet. Ngozi Biko, I am begging you with God's name. If you get there, display every good virtue of a good woman and a good wife. I trust her. Ngozi, your Ooh. cooking skill is very important. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma good character, apply. Yes, I don't want to hear stories of Biko. Hmm? Um, yes. <laughs> 
Her Royal Majesty. I am happy for you. You know you're my mother. I will do my best. I will try to be myself there. Let's go to next year. This is ice cream. This is ice cream. Who is Mbwemela? Who is Mbwemela? That, 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 that's my son. Leave yeah. to see my Akaya! Oh Lord, talk to me! Communicate to me! Talk to me! Where is Maswe again now? That's, that's my name. That, that, Holy that's my God! Name. Thank you, Lord! Holy King of Kings, Lord of Lords! I know you are the King of Kings, you are the Lord of Lords! Your name never changed! Where is Maswe again now? Nikubu, Laka Himosaka, can I prophesy? Can I prophesy? Oh Lord, come and make me, make me, make me done with your person. Your problem is familiar spirits. And the familiar spirits hold you down and say you shall not move. But I said not to such spirit. Today, may such spirit be scattered now in the name of I declare, I prophesy, I pray that such shackles should be released now in the mighty name of Jesus. I carry such spirit and I put it into the bottomless place. I scatter such spirit in the mighty name of Jesus. Receive your healing, receive your glory, receive your breakthrough. Because I know the God I serve is a glorious God. I know the God I serve. Is a living God. You are free. Oh, I thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, God. Thank you, Father, for saving one of your sons once again. I said, the Lord I serve is a living God. Oh, Lord, may your name be highly exalted. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Mekos, the Pelonier. <laughs> Why are you so lonely? You're alone on your seat, no dream, no chicks around, as usual. What's going on? <laughs> you are not you are not in the same frequency with me. What kind of frequency are you now? Are you not sensing something? Sensing words. I'm not actually sensing anything here. I'm sensing Mekus being alone. That's how it should be. Look, you see, that old Mekus. Passed away. You understand? I have swept that lifestyle away. And I've decided to turn a new page of myself. So, this is the new page you see now. Not the old one. Mekus, if I may ask, who is the, uh, the pastor or the reverend that is responsible for this your sudden change in character? Because, yeah, you're not getting it. You know, there comes a time in a man's life. When he sits himself down, advise himself, close an old chapter of him that is not functioning, and of course, turn a new leaf. Doesn't need any prayer from a pastor or a reverend. That's exactly what I've done. Do I know how? Don't be in a rush. <laughs> it's my proper place to It's a surprise. You should need something. Who's there? Get my man drink. We'll have the whole time to talk about it. Saturday night. Hey, 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 I'm thinking of my next line of action. Maybe I should go back to the village so my people will know that I'm still alive. No, I don't think that is necessary. I think you should hang around and see if you can get a job opportunity around here. <laughs> Tony, you just, um, just spoke as if you don't know the country that we are in. Huh? You see, most job opportunities are not done by merit, but by whom you know. Anyway. I will agree with you, but um, you see, I will talk to some of my partners and then business associates to see if something positive will come out. Hmm? For real? Yes. All right. I hope so.
Thank you, man. Story of my life. Story of my life. Because I honestly want to confess to you. From the very day you came into my life, so many things has changed. I know who I used to be, you know, and I, at some point there are things I started avoiding that I never believed I can keep up with it, but as the time goes by, I see myself adapting to it. You're rare, you're special, you're not just beautiful, you're virtuous, and I appreciate it. Please do not stop being you. Thank you. Thank you very much. And I'm glad that we are here today. And you're a nice person too. Thank you. The marriage with the wages. That was why I left. Oh, I see. Um, that'll be all for now. If you're hired, the management will contact you. Alright. Yeah. Thank you, ma'am. You're welcome. Please tell the next person to come in. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Unbelievable. You, the managing director of this big company, of this big company. Yes. That's it. So, tell me, how long have you been job hunting? For more than five years. Five years? Yeah. That's, that's unbelievable. Sandy, I've suffered. I have suffered, it has not, cannot been easy at all. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to why I treated you. I wish I, I wish I listened to you. Please. Forgive me, I'm sorry. Please. It's okay. It's all right, Maxwell. I love yeah. I am so happy that we have finally completed our service here. And I give God all the glory. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So tell me, what's next on your agenda? Ah, you know, as an engineer, I would like to work in an oil servicing company. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. As a matter of fact, I've submitted my CV in some companies. Oh, yeah. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay, I have a proposal for you. A proposal? Mm -hmm. Okay. My car just started yeah. this agro light company. So I want you to come with me so you can work in this company. Honey? Mm -hmm. Is that a joke or something? No, I'm not joking. Do you want your father to tell me to... You want to be an errand boy to your father? Hi, no, come on. That's not what I mean. Honey, you know I would never let my father treat you badly. 
You're my boyfriend and I won't let anyone insult or humiliate you. Well, you know what? I do not want us to overflow this. To cut the long story short, I am not interested in your offer. Okay? Honey, come on. Don't do this. Honey, I, I do not want to talk about this again. I told you earlier, I have submitted and saving some companies and I am waiting for some positive response, okay? Ikena, Ikena, please, I am begging you, come with me. You're not going to regret it. Please. Listen, listen, listen. I want to let you know that I can survive without your parents, without your father. I can make it. Just look at me. I am a qualified engineer. I need to go out there and work for myself and I know that I can make it, okay? I know. But this is an opportunity. This one is handy. I do not want you to miss this opportunity, please. I don't understand that at this point in time. Is this a gimmick for me to get closer to you? Is this a game for you to trap me so I'll finally get married to you? Is this a plan for me to get so glued to you? Listen, uh, listen. For your information, I'm not ready to get married to you or any other one, right? Not now, not even, I am not planning for that. Please, give me space. Okay? Can, can how? Can you say such to me? Is this what you think this is all about? Is it? Kina, please, I beg you. <laughs> I beg I think at this point in time, you're beginning to insult me. Mm. Are you trying to tell me that without your father, Get to work with a certificate. Is that what you're trying to say? Huh? Hey, listen, saying. listen. Enough. Enough of this. Just. You cannot. You cannot, please. I am hey, 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 hey. Don't. 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 You cannot, please. I am begging you. I tried. I tried to get you out of my mind. But you were like an ever flowing stream in my heart. I am sorry. I am deeply sorry. I am not apologizing because you are highly placed in this society. I am apologizing because I know I did something wrong to you. Sandy, you will forever remain evergreen in my heart. I miss you, my Maxi. <sighs> I miss you too. So tell me, how is your husband and how are the kids? I'm single, though in a relationship. Oh. And what about you? I am single. No girlfriend, no wife, nobody. You see, they will never, ever be another Sandra in my life. Never. Breakfast is ready. What? Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> you know, since you came in 
into my life, you just want to destroy me with food <laughs> from one delicacy to another. Ah, oh, baby, enough of your flattery. Come and eat. One more thing. You won't believe it. What? Trust me, this is actually the first time I'm experiencing this breakfast in bed. <laughs> Are you serious? Trust me. Okay. I can wait. Bring it here. <laughs> oh, let me help you. Okay. I just want to watch you eat. <laughs> I want to thank you for employing me to your company. I want to thank you for all the gifts you gave to me. The shirts, the shoes, the furnished apartment, and the car assigned to my office. Honestly, I will forever remain indebted to you. Because you. Each time I try to erase you from my mind, then they get dawn on me that my life is incomplete without you. Tell me, what will I do to stop loving you? I've also tried to stop loving you, but then I realized that I can't live without you. I'd rather die than let you out of my life. For how long will our lives continue being like this? It won't stop until we summon the courage to change it. Sandra, I am ready to make a mend. Will you take me back into your life as your man? Is that what you intend to say? Or do you want me to do it my own way? <laughs> <laughs> you caught me there, Coretta. I am sorry. Sandra. Will you be my wife and the mother of my born children? Talk to me. Or is this just. Or is it just pressure from work? We need to talk. We need to talk. Yeah, is it? Okay. Baby, um, we'll do that when we come back, okay? We'll have to go now. Come back from where? Babe, we can't do this now, okay? Have you forgotten? Emeka is doing an in-house party and he invited us. Look, I can't go for such. I am not in the mood. Please, please don't do this. Don't say no. You know how we are. I and Emeka, we are too close for this. So I don't want to disappoint him. Okay? Just go up and freshen up and let's go. When we come back, we'll talk about this. Okay, please. But I do not want to go. Please. We'll talk about it, okay? Oh, 
What's going on? Because I don't, I don't, I don't just understand it. Then today is supposed to be my happiest day. Why is your girl giving us attitude? What, what, what's all those attitude for? Yeah, I don't think it's all about your engagement, okay? She's been behaving like that. I don't know what is wrong with her. I don't know what has come over her. You know, if not that this thing is all about you, I wouldn't have been here. So I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. You mean she's been like that before now? Yeah. You see, that's not a good sign. You really need to find out what is behind her actions. I thought maybe she wasn't happy that I'm getting married or something. Uh, let's join them. Okay, babe, what is it that you wanted us to talk about? I wanted us to talk about us. About us? Yeah. Because I no longer have feelings for you. I. Hey. I don't understand. What are you talking about? I don't love you anymore. My heart belongs to another. I'm really sorry. Babe, come on, don't say that. Please. What has come over you? What is going on? What happens to the love we built together? What about us? There is no us. There has never been us. Look, Cosy. I just wanted to let you know. I hope and I pray that you find a woman who genuinely loves and cares for you. Babe, please, stop hoping and praying. We are good, okay? Babe, I love you. And you know it. I love you with every bit of my heart. And if, if there's anything I've done to wrong you in any way, I am sorry. Please find a place in your heart to forgive me. I am sorry. I, 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 I don't know what it is, but I will not do it again, okay? I... Oh, see, I can't. I can't love you. My heart belongs to another. Babe? Is this for real or am I dreaming? For Sandra to quit the relationship, it's not ordinary. I must get to the root of this. I must get to the root of this. I will go to her house or to the office and confront her. I think that's what I should do. Let me just switch it up. Okay, if you say so. 
We have to hurry before you miss your flight. Okay. Uh, let me get my bag. We shall go ahead. Gentleman. Okay. Gentleman. 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 Yes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, All right. Mm, I'll miss you. Look, you don't need to thank me. All those privileges are attached to your office. But all the same, you're welcome. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> what is it you wanted us to talk about? Uh, I think we'll have to hasten up with things before that staff will find out that we're seeing each other. Right? Yes. We need to define our relationship. Yeah. First thing first, we'll have to travel this weekend to my place. I have to introduce you to my people, okay? Then on a later day, we'll have to travel to your place. It's so wonderful. Yeah, I know. <laughs> you know I love you, right? And I love you too. Um, let me go to my office, okay? <laughs> Because here, I went to your shop. I went to your shop today, but I couldn't find you. I tried calling your number several times, but you weren't picking. I hope all is well. Amy, I'm not just in the mood. Why? Sandra has left me. What? Oh, did you... Did you offend her in any way? Not at all. Not at all. the problem. I mean, I don't know. I've gone to her house, couldn't find her there, and I went to your face. I noticed that she gave instruction to the security men not to allow me in. Well, I, mean, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I don't just know how to win her back. I don't know what the problem is. This is really serious, you know, but if I am to advise you as my friend, since you did not offend her in any way and she is acting all this funny, I will advise you just let her be. I mean, it is not as easy as you think. I've come to love this girl with all my heart. I've come to love her with, with everything in me. I can just live my life without her. My life is just empty without her. Because you're not going to kill yourself for a woman. Or are you? You need to put yourself together. Bro, take it easy on yourself. Just take it easy on yourself. Hey! Hey! Who <laughs> are oh, oh, okay, oh, eh? I was hearing the sound of a vehicle. I said, ah, who was that? I'm not expecting any guest. All of a sudden, what is happening? Papa. Ikenna, yeah? Is this you? 
<laughs> yes, it's me. <laughs> what is all this? Uh, is it not a Nine. What is this? Nine. You said a car. You tell me about a car. You tell me about a jeep. You tell me about a jeep. You tell me about a trailer. You know that because this car is just a toy compared to that one. My son, what happened? Where have you been? God has blessed you. Amen. Hey! Papi, papi, papi. Hey, papi, like God has blessed my son. <laughs> God has blessed you? Yes, papa. Yo, police in America. No, 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 papa, papa, jiba, na, papa. Eh? Gamu. Yo. Chalupa, chalupa, chalupa. Yo. Ah. Jima, we got so lucky. It is so difficult now to get good man like Ngozi's man. Huh. Like seriously, I'm so happy for her. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Me too. Oh. Ah, my mother, sorry, excuse me. Nemo. How are you? Ah. I am fine. I am very fine. And how is Papa? We are fine, oh. We are fine. Ne -e. hmm. Guess what happened? If you see the kind of big car your brother came, like, came back with, with a lot of goods, foods, beverages, hey! Brody Kenna. <laughs> Mama, I, I don't understand. Nebe, Juan, I'm not joking, no. Oh. If you see his car, his car is as big as a trailer. In fact, Gozier's car looks like a toy compared to his own. <laughs> really? Who? Oh. Mama, wait. How, how come now? Oh, oh, okay, Ma. Thank you for calling me. Okay. Is everything alright? Yes. Yes, everything is fine. Just that my mom called me and told me that Breaking and got a car for himself. Wow. Not only that, he brought goodies back home. Wow. Congratulations to him. Yes. Wow. <laughs> ne, I am happy. I'm also happy for you. So, ne. <clears throat> of my excitement. What you came now? I had an accident. Yes, and um, and um, the good Samaritan who ran into me actually took me to the hospital. Okay, I gave them your phone numbers to get in touch with you, but unfortunately, none of you showed up in the hospital. I, I, I'm sorry. I, 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 I was, you know, uh, almost coming to the hospital. But I was discouraged. Hey, 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 we didn't know you had an accident too. Chai, nah, sorry though. Hey, hey, man, I'm not mad at you. Forgive us. It's okay. It's okay. I've forgiven both of you. If I haven't forgiven both of you, I wouldn't have been here today. Maybe I'll be Maybe I'll be And um, I'm okay. When I was discharged, I, I moved to Lagos, and I'm happy to announce to you that. I got a good job in Lagos. Ifonia? You see my son. My son who has sense. You see my son. Eh, oh, my son. My hard-working son who has sense. I knew you will make it. I had the confidence that you will make it. Come on, nigga, make it. And uh, then again, I... I want to get married. Wow. <laughs> Ah, leave that for your mother. Trust me now. I know all the whole good girls in this community. They are, they are as well. Watch I can wise work that can cook and take care of the home. Trust me, I will get one for you. Very good one. Nice looking one. I'm a choice, mother. I will get my choice for you. I will make a leg. It's good, mother. Hey. Thank you so much, Mama. Thank you for trying to help me out. But I already found one. Hey, yeah. he can. Papa. <laughs> In that case, 
bring her home. Let me use a new key. I will do that, but that should be over the weekend. Okay, weekend. This very weekend. This weekend, yeah. Okay, very, very, very. We go. What we can also keep our day, Tom. When you want to marry, you can't do whatever. We can start from there. I have seen you. Stop, stop. Are you from this village? Yeah, I'm from this village. Uh, do you know anyone from here? Yes. My ex-friend is from this village. Oh. It's okay. You see, my parents will be happy to see you. Are you sure? Oh, yeah. Do you think they would like me? Come on, babe. You're a likable person. They have no choice. Stop, stop, stop. Don't tell me this is your parents' house. Oh, of course. It is. Oh, somebody tell me I'm dreaming. Honey? Tell me, am I dreaming? Is this a dream? Any problem? Kosi has brought me here to see your parents. Kosi? Yes. My own younger brother. You two know each other? Yes, I, I know him. But the love I have for him vanished when I saw you. Ah. Faze, it's unbelievable. Oh my goodness, I... I never imagined such scenario. I'm... What do I do? Look, I can't continue. Okay, no, let no, me no, just no, go. No, 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 Let me just go, please. I can't see Listen, them. She's going nowhere. Okay? We are here already. Listen, listen. We we'll have to do this for ourselves. For you, for me, for us. Auntie Sandra. Mama. Auntie Sandra. I'm obeying It's, it's Sandra, the one you all know. What is your relationship with my son? Papa, Papa, please calm down. It's not what you think. I will explain. Explain what? That you have seen my two sons? Talk, talk! Uh, Papa, can we, can we sit and talk about this? Imagine this. You can, have you gone gaga?
हेलो 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 I yes. I call him now. Ikenna, Ikenna came and my own Sandra in the village. Are you sure of what you're saying? Okay. okay thank you. Um, Susie, let me rush off to the village. Yeah? I'll, I'll be back soon in case anybody come looking for me. Okay? Take care of this place, please. Okay? Yeah. So that was how it happened. I never knew that Maxwell, that Ikena, and Gozi were brothers. I never wished for this drama to happen. I never wished for that. Papa. Mama. I see, this can't happen to anyone. And I hope you understand her plight. If you ask me, it's true. Her story is quite understandable. They can. What happens? If your brother Gozier discovers that Sandra left him for you. My own is, I do not want my two sons to fight each other because of a woman. Ah. Um, <clears throat> but we are one family. Uh, we can sort out things as, as one family. Please, Over I... my dead body. Over my dead body. Come down for what? We can resolve this as Resolve well, what? It. Huh? Resolve what? You're so wicked. Because I'm not wicked. I met her before you. Trust me. But You met her before me. You took my woman from me. And, and you're trying to tell me. You, 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 you're trying to patronize me. My son said enough of this. No, it's not enough, Dad. It's not enough. It's so wicked. Who? You know we're so much in love. And you did what you're doing. Is, is that right? Hey, hey, hey I, I cannot calm down. Watching you take over my woman, over my dead body, is not going to be possible. But so what is wrong with you? Huh? Have I not respected you enough? What is your problem? Huh? Okay. Forget. You see what you've got. She's not the problem, mom. She is not the problem. Is this my wicked brother? Is the problem? And who is wicked? It's you. I'm not respecting you. Enough. You are the younger one. I deserve. You're causing this problem. You're the problem. What is it? Hey, 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 what is wrong with both of you? Huh? No. Yeah, I, 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 I waste you. I'll just break your head. Please, I will waste stop your it. life. Break your head. Try me. Stop it. Do you want to kill yourselves? Is that it? Look, I am not going to stand here and watch you both fight to have me. You two claim to love me, but all I see is hate. Love does not hurt, but heals. It doesn't divide, but unites. What is all this? Please. Uh, 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 my, my, my sons. Uh, please, let us go and sit down and talk these things over. I am your father. This is not how I raised you. I was already on the plane of, of peace before you stepped in, Gozi. Please, let's just go and sit down. We will talk this thing. I am here. Please drop your weapon. If you both claim to love me, drop the weapons. Ikenna. Kosie. Please, let's go out and talk this over. Like I said before. Huh? Let's talk it over. I am here. What is the sense of me being here and all of you will be fighting over a woman? Never no handle. Please, let's go and talk this thing over once and for all. If I'm not okay, say me about him. Hey, 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 hey! Don't! Don't come close to me! Hey, if you come close to me, I will kill myself. Okay. I'm tired. 
It hurts me to do this. It hurts me so bad. But I think this is the only way for peace to reign. For you both to stop fighting. Stop fighting to have me. This is the only way out. Okay, okay, please don't do this. You know, if you do this, it's going to hurt me. You know how much I love you. You can't just do this. You can't just take your life. Okay? Oh, okay, okay, we're, we're, we're here together now. Please, make your choice, okay? Make your choice on, on who you want. My love. Please. The most beautiful angel. If you choose me, that's okay. If you choose him, that's okay. But I am promising you that we will make a good husband to you, okay? Am I, am I speaking your mind? Yes, yes. Cosie, Cosie, I love you. You're a nice and a kind-hearted person. You will always have a special place in my heart. Ikenna, you're not perfect. But despite all your imperfections, I choose you to be my husband and the father of my children. Give it to me. Give me the knife. Help. You see why I told you. Story of my life, only can get color. Story of my life, only can get color. If you want to name it one day, only can get color.